Pick up my brand new book in the description down below. Do you ever have those days where you're just not feeling it art-wise? You're not really quite awake mentally? Doing some building behind this art piece right here, something I was gifted for nothing. It was being thrown away. Are they framing components of a tree house I'm working on for a client? I build a lot of tree houses for people, design them, A-frame cabins, all that. Check out my plan set below. You know the drill. But the batteries on my Milwaukee driver were dead, so I'm charging them right now and killing time with this. This could go horribly wrong because I'm free forming all this, as I actually always do. Um, it's just kind of a graffiti robot piece atop a very kind of terrible, maybe Japanese influenced print. So I really can't lose. This was trash. It has no value. It's a little bit warped. It's not going to sell. I'm just going to have fun with it and see what happens. Right, so as you can clearly see, I went back and looked at the time-lapse footage. The light got terrible. So let me see if I can move around here and show you kind of what's going on without making you sick. I might just have to move the painting altogether. Here it is so far. This is a better shot of it. I'm gonna let this dry for a bit and then use some uh, huge Sharpie markers to work in some detail, some shape, some craziness and just see what happens. It's okay so far. Not loving it. A little grumpy looking. Not really like a positive graffiti painting. Maybe we can change that. We'll see. So here's the final thing from a weird angle, and I kind of dig it. I really like the colors, in fact, how the blue, green, and those, you know, aqua scape colors go together. Let me flip the camera around and show you a better view, because this is making it all distorted and stretched out. There you go. Very quick in the slashes and movements. And that's kind of what I've been digging lately. Simple, colorful, bold, fun, ain't no work of art. But I had a good time making it. Total time to create, not that long. The drying time in between took the longest because I layered so much paint from the get-go. I do a lot of antennas, you know, sci-fi, vintage throwback antennas in the art. I have been doing that for a while. I don't know why. I just like it. Fills up that void, too. So there you go. Weird solar flare thing there. As always, thanks for watching. I know this isn't a tiny house video or a tree house, but thrift wise, repurposing, reuse wise, it all kind of ties in. I feel so. Thanks for watching. As always, check both the channels out, subscribe. I'd love you for it, and I'll see you next time. Mm -hmm.